Welcome my Dab Sources family. In this channel, we teach how to make money online via affiliate marketing, Amazon KDP, and other ladies site hustle. And if you're a returning subscriber, you're welcome. Thank you for stopping by. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And if you are new in this channel, please just do us a favor. Give this video a thumbs up and hit the notification button so whenever we conclude a new valuable content so that you will get notified so you will not miss our our amazing um content so in this video tutorial we are going to discuss we are going to teach about how you can create a motivational gratitude journal on canva using the free version and upload it on amazon and make cash so let's go so on your browser type in canva.com so when your page comes like this all you need to do is to go to your custom size and customize your size you're going to use so make it know that when you are using a 6 by 9 or 8 by 5.11 so let's go Let's customize our size. Then click here. For now, I'm going to create and make sure you select the inches um, you are going to use. So uh, now I'm going to select, I'm going to create on 8.25, 8.625 by 11.25. So let's go. 8.625. By 11.25, then you click on create a new design. Once you click on create a new design, then you allow it to open. All right, once you are, once you are here, then all you need to do is to go to file on your file, then click on show margin. Once you click on show margin, take note that whatever you are creating shouldn't pass this margin. This dotted line, it shouldn't pass this margin. Like I said, we are going to create a unit, um, a multi, a motivational gratitude journal, and we are going to make a cash while we upload it on Amazon. So, if you are new, please just give us thumbs up. If you have not given us, what are you waiting for? Just do that and give this video a thumbs up. And if you want us to make another content related to this, and uh, just drop your on your comment section, then we'll come and we reach out to you. All right. All right. Now we'll go to L um, element and select any of the thing you want to do. Like I said. I'm doing a motivational journal. I'm doing a motivational journal that will help you to time your day-to-day -day business. So now I'm going to design it. So I'm clicking on this file. You can search anything on Unicorn. Then you minimize it and drag it. Then you can remove the color and make it like black and white. So. Then you go to text, then you add your text like I said, I'm doing a um, this one. So I'm going to do I believe in myself. I believe. In myself. So to motivate you on your daily um, activities. So you can click on this place, the arrow down, and select the type of font you want. Then you can slant it if you want. You can slant it if you want. Then you can bold it if you want. So that's, you can highlight. Click on slant, it will slant. Click on bold, it will bold. Then you can reduce or increase the size of this cell. One and me, I'm going to reduce it and make it readable. Okay, then I'll drag it, position it in the place you want it to be. Okay, that's so lovely. So, another thing is to 
another thing is to all right let's continue now we are going to do what duplicate this you click here that said duplicate then you duplicate it and you drag it and position it where you want it to be then we are going to change this test okay you highlight it and type the test you want okay let's highlight and make it a little bit good so you can be able to highlight then you type what you want let me say um day of the week so to to plan your dates okay then you can drag it and position it in the place and the place you want you can reduce the font and drag it so all these things you need to measure it accurate then you go back to element and click on line then you position the line where you want it to be where you want it to be okay that's good you reduce it and make sure it's in, in a straight form i hope you are getting value on this content make sure it's in a straight form so what else you position it very well then another thing is to do what write your goal then you can duplicate this test click on duplicate and drag it and position it here and you can highlight the inside and write my goal And write your goal as cool. Then, if you want to change the font style, you can click here to change the font style. But as for me, I think I will leave it. I'm cool with the font style. So, I'm cool with the font style. So, you can just style your your book, anything. You can use a different type of font style. Any type of answer you want, you can use it, okay? Now this one um, is not cool for me. Let me uh, and anytime you make mistake, you click on this arrow to undo, all right? So now this is what, then you duplicate this line again, click on duplicate, drag it and come on, position it, okay? Good. So, what next we are doing our design. So, now we are going to duplicate this. Duplicate it to position it wall place. Okay. Yeah. We are going to duplicate this test again because we want to write another thing. So, I hope you are getting value. Just give this video a thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed, just hit the notification um, bell. So now we're going to start our business. business. Because we are monitoring our day of the week. So this one is okay. Then you can bold it or reduce it. You can increase it a little bit. That's cool. So we want to bring out the um, diagram. So you can use this thing to rotate it. To rotate it. Here. Don't worry if you're hearing a background sound. I'm a model, and this video I'm not ready to edit it. All right? So bear with me. I'm a model. Children. Two children. So you can see the kids are always there to make noise. So now we are dragging this. You can position it. Okay, let's do this one first. Then click on this duplicate because we want to then drag it. Drag it. This is the boss we are going to write inside. Okay. 
and hydration mix hydration interface are the same part right. you can duplicate it you position it again just make sure everything is in order and you can stress form and you can drag this one and take this one and position it Okay, this is not so. Okay, there. Okay. Let's see how it is. Okay, then you can position this one a little bit down. Position run a little bit down so you have to be creative the position this one a little bit down okay. so cute it's our the space of this one is a little bit bigger you can use your make it down a little bit so this is how you do it and you create it. So let's drag it and use it. Right. So you can use your arrow to demonstrate the line to make it out instead of dragging, dragging, dragging. The arrow to make it up. Okay. okay. That's all about it. To make the do this thing, you want to make it to suit. Then you can easily delete this if you want. Okay. Then now we are going to duplicate this because we want it to match what we are doing. So we will do this again. We want it to be seen more. Let's see how it is. Click outside. Okay. Then take it off a little bit. Why you do Take this one off a little bit. Take this off a little bit. So this one will be here. So this is how you do it. You take this up to this. This is how you go about it. Okay. So to make sure everything is in order, you monitor your. If you find it difficult to position it, you can come to position and click on center. Everything will run, okay? Then you drag it up a little bit, a little bit. Then you duplicate this and drag it down. Take it, drag it again. Drag it down this I think this one a little bit down. And this a little bit down. Wow. I think that's cool. 
then you bring this one a little bit down. Just make sure everything is in. Everything is in order. That's how you roll it. Okay, I think we are good to go. I think we are good to go. Let's put this a uh, little bit off. Let's take this. Sorry, I have cold. But it's not for long. Ah. Now we are good to go. Now we are good to go. Okay, because we are going to duplicate this again. Let's duplicate this. And we are going to bring it close to this place. Yes. We are going to bring it close to this place. So you drag this one and put here. Then get um, click on this business and duplicate it and drag it and position it here. Then we have to change the test because we are working on our daily week journal gratitude. Then click on the test and write personal. Hold it, click on board. And highlight it. Click on board. You can slant it if you want. Okay. You position it. And position it. Okay. We are good to go. Then minimize this a little bit. Then position this a little bit. Then take this up a little bit. Okay. Then take this up a little bit. Take this up a little bit. Then you can click on this again and duplicate. Also duplicate, drag it and position it to this side. And make sure, don't forget, whatever you are creating to do past the the dotted line, all right? Then you click on this duplicate um, personal and click on duplicate, then duplicate it and drag it down. Once you drag it down, make sure it doesn't pass the margin, then you highlight and write orders. Write orders. Okay. Then... Double click on it, highlight, bold it, and slant it. So, double click this one. Right. So, this is how we create our um, day to day journal. Um, I believe you enjoying the content. So, now we are going to make it up to. 100 pages and 120 pages. So you know that Amazon, um, uh, Amazon in this kind of journal gratitude will require 120 others. The sellers are doing it, so you should do the same. And another thing here is that you need to be creative, all right? So now we are going to duplicate this to 120, but in this Canva, Canva can give you only the maximum of 100 pages because we are using the free version, okay? So click on this, find that the duplicate page. Do not do add page. Click on this, you duplicate the page. Then you can see we have two. Now, you duplicate it to the how many pages until you get to 100 um, pages, okay? Then another thing is to, once you get to 100 pages, all you need to do is to do what? 
come to this first one. Once you come to this first one, you highlight everything. Once you highlight everything, you click on delete. Once you click on delete, because we are going to design our title page, and we are going to make it look so beautiful. All right. So in this um this one, you can say I can do it or anything you you want to believe. But we are using I believe in myself. So now what we are going to do is to click on first again. Once you click on first, you click on add heading. Once you click on add heading, you can uh, I believe I believe in myself. That is what we are doing. Like I said, you may hear the background noise. Just bear with me. I'm a mother. Um, but I believe in myself. Then all you need to do is go back to this place. You can highlight it. Like the whole pages. Go, you can reduce or increase. Go to this place and, and change the Choose any form you want, all right? Once you choose any form you want, yeah. once you choose any form, you can position it because we are making a this thing. The title page, we are making the um, title page. So click on the, I believe in myself, then you duplicate this, go back and duplicate this. Okay, click on this sign to say duplicate. Once you duplicate, you drag it down, then you highlight all. Once you highlight all, you say the, the Jonah belongs to. Then once you do that, you could you click on this sign, you drag it this size. This one is okay. I love this one. You can position it like I said. If you don't know where the center is, you click on these three dots and click on position. Is at the center already? If you click me, it will come down. But let's just make it in a good way. Then you click on it. You can drag it. You can minimize it and make it smaller. Okay. You can click on the plus sign to increase it. That's all. Just, just be creative and. Uh, make your book to stand out on amazon so now we are going to upload um let's give you we are gi giving this in a, a sweet design then you can click on this and click on so like i said we are giving this as, as a design so you can go to element and search for anything you want to Okay, you can search for any, maybe unicorn, you search for anything that you want to use, okay? Then you can be able to use it to create and design your donor. Click on enter, then you will see so many amazing um, images that you can use to just give your book a sweet, um, Fine. Okay, so let's start for one. Let's start for one to use. Because this has a free version, so you have to be creative because others are still using this uh, free um, template. I can say you can select anything. So I, you search for unicorn. I'm using this one. I'll use this template. So. All you need to do is to what, drag it. Uh, no. Uh, all you need to do is to drag like this to minimize it. Then position it. Position it. Then you increase it. You increase it the way you want it. Sorry. Okay. Once you increase it, 
drive it from here. Then you can write anything on top. This is so amazing. Our book is so amazing. Then you can increase the size. Increase the size. Center is when you hear a baby by grand, please. My daughter insists you will stay with me and do this. Do this. You just bear with me. As a mother, a star home mother, this is what you see when you are creating a content. <laughs> all right, so that's all about how you can design a beautiful a motivational journal for your own personal goals all right now we are going to you can design as many as these pages and design as many as this you can all right now we have finished creating our journal for our gratitude journal is this not amazing so all you need to do is to do what download this as pdf so click on file once you click on file you go straight to this download you can remove the margin if you want so click on file go down and click on download once you click on download allow it to come up then you select you select here as pdf because amazon require pdf select this pdf print and select how many pages it is and you click on download and go and save it on your anywhere you want to save it so another thing is you have to go to amazon to upload this content so stay tuned to get there all right so like and share if you have not subscribed hit the notification bell. and if you want us to make any content related to another thing like this just drop your comments on the comment section all right So title it and save it wherever you want to save it, okay? Um, check where I, anywhere you want to save it, then you save it. I'm going to save mine on my desktop. So I'm going to show you how you can match the two files together, okay? Now, after we have finished downloading our PDF, our manuscript as PDF, all we need to do is to do it. Go to our Chrome browser, then we go to smallpdf.com to match our file. Like I said before, Amazon um, um, Canva will give you minimum of, uh, maximum of, sorry, maximum of 100 um, pages because you are using the free version. But now we want to make this file so that we can get up to 120 pages in this uh, file. Then you go to small PDF. Once you go to smallpdf.com, then you click on Match PDF. Once you click on Match PDF, then allow it to open. Then you click on Choose File. Okay. Once you click on Choose File. Once you click on choose for you, allow it to come up, then it will automatically take you to where you have already saved the file. Let's wait a little bit. I think my network is slow. And if you have not given this video a thumbs up, what are you waiting for? Just do that for us to help. And this, uh, content. So let's go to where we save our file. We save it as on the desktop. Let's go to manuscript, novel manuscript. Let's go to novel manuscript. Let's go to um, 
I believe this is the PDF that will open it. Once you open it, you allow it to upload. It's loading. So this is what you will need to do to just make you can upload as many you can make this pdf as many as you want sorry if you are hearing background noise background on the uh, i'm a star home mom so now all you need to do is to enable this once you enable this you go to choose options Go to choose option. This is the um, PDF we have um, we, we created on Canva and we have uploaded here. Then we go to another one. Then you can make as many as you want to. Okay. So here is telling you to download. We have 120. Let's go back. You can click plus or minus. Let's go back. Let's go back. Another page. All right. You click on add more. Once you click on my add more, you click on choose file again. Once you click on choose file again, then it will automatically take you to the same place you save. Then you click on it to add um, the PDF. So now we have added the PDF. All you need to do is to click on Merge PDF. So all you need the uh, Let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go. So if you have not given this video a thumbs up, please give it a thumbs up. And if you are a new subscriber and you have not subscribed to this channel, what are you waiting for? Hit the notification button. And if you are a returning subscriber to GAF Success, welcome to my family. All right, this is all we have now. And you can see in this place is saying 121 PDF files. All you need to do is to do what? Download it. Once you download it, then you have, remember, we created 100 PDF on Canva. All right, so all you need to do is to download, download, download it. The uh, PDF has downloaded, then you click on open. Once you click on open, you see your PDF. So now we are going to go to Cam uh, Amazon KDP. Kindle, sorry, Amazon. We are going to go. We are going to Amazon to upload our content. All right. If you don't know, if you do not have account with Amazon, you have to create account on Amazon and upload your content and make money. All right. And if you want to know how these things are done step by step, how you can design a paper cover, a paper bag like this like this paper cover, how you can design your paper cover, how you can do keyword research, how you can spy your competitors, how you can spy the best sellers, what makes them the best sellers, and how you can stand out to become your own best seller on Amazon. So reach out to me, I'll drop my WhatsApp number to connect with me, how you can design all this amazing paper bag, Halloween, paper bag, Halloween content, horror books, color, kids coloring books, and etc. Then reach out to me via WhatsApp and let's do business. I'm great. Our, our next training, um, Amazon coaching classes is coming up soon. So do not miss this amazing because we are giving out 80% discount. So reach out to me via the description on this um, on this content and if you want to know how to make money on affiliate marketing and other ladies you can connect with me later. thank you for stopping by and have a wonderful day